my question is why would Jesus cry knowing that he is God and he had said that all this uh, happened that the father may glorify himself so he knew that Lazarus is going to die but still he cried was there a reason why he was crying what cost him uh, Lazarus was not the last the first or the last person that maybe Jesus raised from death because uh, he had raised uh through daughter he has met dead people and all of them he raised them but he didn't cry over this even the child that died Jesus did not weep over that child why would jesus weep over that hi viewers thank you for tuning in i'm glad that you are in thank you for they that have subscribed they that have watched then the humble beginning the god of job and everything i'm just so glad and today i i wanted to talk about weeping god where jesus wept when he was told that his friend lazarus was dead and uh, i i came to ask myself why did jesus wept when lazarus died as a believer as a christian how many times have we met jesus to weep over us okay maybe he wept because lazarus died before he accomplished his purpose in life maybe he wept because uh, he was his his friend and some of the, sometimes we find that uh, young people are dying before they accomplish their their purpose in life and that cause god to weep and what goes us to have this early death as a Christian? What? How many times have you made the Holy Spirit to grieve over you for the things we do? It might not be that physical death, or but maybe you die spiritually and you never know because you have come out of the will of God. You have not accomplished that God that that, that God wants you to accomplish in life. So what am I trying to say? As a Christian, is it possible to walk a whole life to be guided by the Holy Spirit that you may fulfill? Because the desires of our, as a, the desires of my heart as mercy is that I may fulfill my purpose on earth, that I may walk in the ways of God, that I may ask the Holy Spirit to lead me, to guide me in everything that I do as a believer. And you as a believer. Is it possible to ask? Because uh, we were told in this life it's not easy. That's why Jesus decided to send us help. We know we have a lot of challenges, we have a lot of up and downs and everything, but there is a help who can help you walk in this salvation, in this journey of salvation, and you will make it. So you make this cry to your heart as a believer that um, you may walk without without um, grieving the whole thing, without grieving God, without um, hurting God. Most of the time I told that the time every time we sin is like we are crucifying Jesus again. So how will we walk? How will we do it as a Christian without hurting God? It's only by the help of the Holy Spirit because uh, by ourselves we may seem by our flesh or by everything, our actions, but if you have the Holy Spirit guiding you, leading you, then you can reach in this life. Thank you for watching this program, Blessing Moments. If you have not subscribed, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Masi Achim Odero. Please subscribe, and if you have subscribed, share so that someone somewhere may be blessed, may be encouraged. Thank you, and have a good day.